Zanzi singer Zandila Kumalo has told the High Court in Pretoria that she can't say for sure that her sister, Kelly Kumalo, did not pull the trigger of a gun that killed soccer star Sedzo Miyua. Yikes. Hey, hey, I'm Zanzi. Hello and welcome to Entertainment News in Zanzi. If you're new to my channel, you know, you're here for the stories, go ahead, click the subscribe button and, of course, the bell and you'll never miss an update. So, Mzanzi, the former Bufana Bufana captain was in a relationship with Kelly when uh, he was shot in what's believed to be a botched uh, robbery at the Kumala home in Foss Lewis in 2014. Now, while five men are on trial for Miyua's murder, there is still speculation about the circumstances surrounding uh, the footballer's uh, murder. Zandi Kumala is on the stand for a second week, Mzanzi, as uh, the rebooted De Novo sends a Miyua murder trial continues again on Tuesday. I'm sure Lola says evidence pictures only show those two cans this does not depict all the alcohol you bought more correct Mshalala also said so there is no evidence submitted to the court pro uh, proving the exact amount of alcohol purchased and consumed uh, that night Mshalala read a witness stand from a neighbor suggesting that another neighbor Maggie Piri cleaned uh, the house after the shooting but before the police could arrive now, Mzansi, Mshalala also continued and said, what was that deceased wearing? Kumala said jeans and a white t-shirt. Mshalala said the intruders. Kumala said, I cannot remember. Mshalala said, your mom, Kelly, long way. While Kumala said, I can't remember. Controversial second docket in the Senzo Miyua trial is set to haunt the singer Zandi Kumala again as defense lawyers gun for those that were in the house when Miyua was shot. While Zandi was, has previously told the court that one of the intruders was Bongani in Danzi, however, the identity of the shooter remains unknown. Defense lawyer Zandi Lemshalolo's proposition is that there were no intruders on that fateful day and that Miyua was killed by someone in his close circle of friends. Now, the reason why you are failing to give a full description of the hood of the second suspect, including the color of the hoodie that the second suspect was wearing, is that there was no second suspect. You are fabricating the story. Now, Mr. Lola pressed Zandi during cross-examinations, Mzanzi, about Kelly's whereabouts during the scuffle that led to the first shot being fired. Mr. Lola said, you did not see if Kelly was able to disarm the firearm from the suspect and shoot the deceased. Zandi said, that's your opinion advocate i did not see it now the state said that it did not plan to call kelly to testify while the defense said it will launch an application and call her to come and speak for thyself now there you have it mzansi let me know what your thoughts are about all of this shenanigans in the comment section you know i love to hear from you but for now you know i will bring you the updates hot just the way you like it